What is going on Ohana? Welcome back to another video. I am currently right now at the Disneyland Resort and as you guys can tell right behind me the castle is now completely covered with snow. And of course with Halloween over and everything like that I had to cover it for you guys. Unfortunately Kanani is not here with me. She's back at home. She's you know she's trying to bundle up because today is a little bit of a breezy cool day. I don't want her to get sick. Before anything guys, I just want to let you know if you guys are new, go and hit that sub button. Like always, we want to make sure everyone enjoys the Ohana. We want to see a girl for you guys. We want everyone to get along, talk amongst yourselves in the comments down below. But also guys, if you guys like the content, go and hit the like button. You know, it just helps out with Anani Vibe to get out there in the YouTube world. And most importantly guys, if you guys are returning, hit the bell. The post notification is going to help you keep updated here with everything on Anani Vibes. So with enough talking guys, let's go ahead and get this adventure started and let's see what's new. If you guys are still wondering if the Pumpkin Pursuit's going on, if they have some stuff over in downtown Disney, they actually do. The Pumpkin Pursuit is still going on until while supplies last and they even have the pumpkin still up all over downtown Disney. So now's your chance to be able to catch all that stuff before it's completely gone. <laughs> all right, guys. So if you guys could tell right next to me, this is Sergio. You guys have seen him in the Not Scary Farm video. We deci oh, I decided to join him today. I don't want to leave him hanging, you know, going in the parks by himself. You know, he's taking a couple pictures, which by the way, guys, if you guys aren't following him on Instagram, it's going to be right over here. Feel free to, you know, follow his, his IG. He takes pictures for all the theme parks and all that stuff. And he had just finished his first Whoa. year at Fright Fest as a slider. And a demon. And a demon. And a demon. <laughs> so yeah guys, show him some love, let him know that I'm not in vibe, sent you guys, you know. But most importantly, hit the likes on the on the pictures, on his posts. Oh, thank you, thank you. Alright guys, so we made our way out of Batu, and on the way out, we actually caught Eeyore. And unfortunately, someone made him blush. Can't help it, I'm handsome. <laughs> but yeah, as you guys can tell over by the partner statue, or what they call the hub, all the pumpkins are now gone. I think Disney's over Halloween. Alright guys, so we made our way into Plaza Point and we just had to do a little quick walkthrough and everything of course because we can't do the whole entire thing because Kanani would butcher me. All the stuff for, uh, for the holidays and everything are pretty nice. They got all the ornaments and everything as you guys can see. But the store right next to Plaza Point, they still have Halloween merch. Everything down from the pillows to some other stuff. You know, they really don't have too much because oh, now hard. it is over. So yeah, they still have some stuff. They have like Halloween towels and everything still up. So if you guys do come to the parks, you guys want the Halloween merch still, head over to the store. Guys, look, we found Stitch. Stitch. Oh, uh, yeah, pose, strike a pose, strike a pose. There we go. One more, yeah, work it, Stitch, work it. Aww. There we go. <laughs> All right, guys, so as soon as you make your way through Frontierland, if you head right over to Rancho del Zocalo, they do have their Christmas decorations up as well, too. Hey, guys, look who we ran into. We got distracted with Jack from Pirates of the Caribbean, not from Nightmare Before Christmas. But if you guys make your way over to New Orleans Square, if you check right behind me, all the Christmas decorations are all up. So yeah guys, 
They got some decorations that are over here on the tree, but all the garlands and uh, ornaments are all up. If you just make your way through New Orleans Square, you could be able to see all the rest of the decorations that they do have up as well too. But I think this is the mainland as of today or as of now that is pretty much decked out in holiday decorations. How's it going, Miguel? All right, guys, so as you make your way through Frontierland, you could be able to head over to the Zocalo Park where they have the Dia de los Muertos set up and you guys might be able to see a familiar face. We were able to get a couple pictures with Miguel and we did get some shots for you guys. But I gotta say, before we end the video, there's one thing we should end off the video with. So let's hover to DCA. So we made our way over to California Disney. Actually took down the Headless Horseman. The trees and everything should be up soon. And there's a couple people that we actually ran into just right now over at Buena Vista Street. Check it out. Yeah guys, as soon as we crossed over to DCA, we ran into Mickey, Oswald, and of course, the Pluto, and... <laughs> we ran into Pluto and Daisy. Hola amigos, give a warm welcome to the storytellers of Plaza de la Familia and their musical celebration of Coco. And we are the storytellers of Plaza de la Familia! We celebrate the heartwarming story of Goto. In this wonderful story, a 12 year old boy named Miguel sets out on an extraordinary adventure into the land of the dead, where he unlocks an age old family history. Miguel dreams of singing and playing the guitar! Just like us, his passion is music! Hey, yeah. Exactly. I 
journey where he meets a charming sister named Endor, who helps him find the courage to fulfill his music of destiny. we had to end the video with a little show so you know for when this video comes out I believe Dia de los Muertos is gonna be completely over for the celebration and everything myself and Kanani actually wrote something for the uh, you know the uh, the tree of life that they had over there at the Plaza de Familia and you know of course for the people that we love and for the people that we lost you know they're always dear to our hearts you guys know the number one rule with Ohana for us. You know, Ohana means family. Family means no one gets left behind. This has its own magic. Alright guys, thank you guys so much for watching, um, you know, everything that we did cover here over at the Disneyland Resort, whether if it's Disney side or California Disney side, we just kind of wanted to give you a little bit of what had happened or what has been going on over here because of course it is now Christmas season coming up, but don't forget guys, it is Thanksgiving coming up soon. It's November. Don't forget about Turkey Day. If you guys enjoyed everything that I did cover today, everything from the castle to, you know, the little updates or the little decorations or, your you know, outfit that the grizzly bear had changed into right after Halloween. Thank every single one of you guys for joining me on this adventure today. Just want to say guys, if you guys are new, go ahead and hit the sub button. We would greatly appreciate all or every single one of you guys joining just so that we could see how big the uh, you know the Ohana gets especially for you guys but if you guys are returning go ahead and turn on that bell those post notifications gonna keep you updated with everything here on Nani Vibes and of course if you guys enjoy the video or if you guys have enjoyed the content posted on Nani Vibes go ahead and hit the like button 
you know it would help us spread the love and the ohana and everything like that for the channel so guys thank you guys so much this is tim i'll see you guys next time on another video peace out